who are you hugging on at the end there? You, what, Jakea. What? Okay. Yeah, let the rock so happy. That's because Nikki had answered me. I said, yes, we're getting it. It's like, yeah, I'm so happy. It's been a long time coming, y'all. Uh, I think a little bit, yeah. I think we've also just been focusing on that a lot in practice and we watch film, just having quicker starts because we know that's kind of gotten us in trouble a little bit in the past couple games. So today was a big one um, for us to come out and win the last regular season on our home court. Um, and we still have another one that we have to come out with the same energy. <laughs> oh, I have no idea, honestly. <laughs> like, I was, it was different emotions. Like, I was saying, I'm going to cry or I'm going to be happy. I don't know, I'm just so happy today. I'm just, I don't know, I'm just full of joy right now. <laughs> I don't remember. Yeah, we was playing a blue, a light blue team. Don't think much about that. I didn't touch the floor like that. So the only game I remember is the uh, red and white scrimmage that we did my freshman year, and I was like so excited for the red and white scrimmage. Everyone was like, like at least it's not a real game. But I was like so excited, like had the jersey on for the first time. There was like, like just chill out. But that's all. That's all I remember from the beginning. Just surreal. Like, has many times we've walked off that court, like hit people's hands and like especially at the end of the game like after a big win but like for that to be like one of the last times in Reynolds Coliseum like to hug all the coaches yeah. all the players on the team like it's just like you want to take a mental image of it but there's so much to encapsulate that you just can't put it to words uh I mean I think KJ started hitting shots early she had like 13 at the half or something like that so we just try to keep feeding it inside um we are getting productive from there I think we hit a lot of outside outside shots in the first quarter um, but then we kind of missed some in the second quarter, so we just started to play inside out, and we were making them, so we just kept going in. I mean, I just think we wanted it, like, really bad, um, especially this year for the regular season. Like, it's something we focused on at the beginning of the year. We said, this is our goal, you know. Obviously, we have goals in postseason, too, but this is the goal for right now, um, this short-term goal. So I think everyone just, like, hard work and going towards the goal. Like, everyone had to give up. Everyone had to sacrifice and be mm -hmm. selfish and everything, so... I think just for us to be able to come out here and like actually get it done and see that, oh, we can do regular season, so now what's next in the tournaments? Same question. Oh, yeah, I, I love this. Cause I feel like the the first year we won it, it was just we didn't care who had the spotlight or whatever. We just wanted to win, and that carried on to the second year. And now it's with this team also. Like, I think we have different leading scores every night, right? So it's just we selfless, and that's what makes us win, and it helps us. Yes, for sure. <laughs> yeah, we talked about it. During the summer, Coach Moore, I uh, always say, what's that place you got at NIL? Uh, Amigos? Amigos. <laughs> yeah, it was there. <laughs> and I told him, I was like, so if we get a regular season, do we get another ring? He said, yes, yeah, so it's been a goal since summer. Yes. Yeah, for sure. So happy I had this baby here. <laughs> so, because that was a goal, too. Like We had, we had multiple goals going into this year. Um, I told Coach Moore I wanted three more rings or whatever, two, three. So, yeah. I don't know. You just got to stay hungry. And that's, he always tells us that. Stay hungry. Because when I mean, you can't settle, yeah, you got one, but it's more out there. Mm -hmm. ACC tournament? For sure. That's the next goal. And that's the one we focus on right now. Yeah. We can soak this one in for the day. And then <laughs> Tuesday, we back at it. Yeah, I mean, you think about it. We're seniors. We're leaving. Uh, and we're leaving the next group of kids to grow up in this program. Um, mm -hmm. So I think that we've just tried our best to help them grow, to teach them. And so to see them out there, like, balling out kind of as our goodbye, um, I'm just super proud of them. And it's been hard, you know, it's hard on the freshmen. It was hard when KJ and Kai came back and Raina for another year. So everyone on this team has just battled every day. And so for them to let that shine on the court today was just amazing. Uh, I mean, yeah, that's one of the reasons <clears throat> why I came to NC State. It was a great program, but I wanted to take it to another level. I wanted to be a part of the NC State legacy. Um, and over my four years, we've done that, you know. And it's not even in the championships we've won, but it's in the culture that we bring to the team, um, the relationships that we've made. And so... I didn't come here just to be another person, a part of NC State. I came here to make a difference, and I think that shows in everything. Out there as well. <laughs> For sure. Yeah, you can drag us back. <laughs>